It's the Mitchers, back with another quick movie review. And today we're gonna re rewind time just a little bit and we're gonna talk John Wick 1, the first one. So I have always been a Keanu Reeves fan. Huge fan of The Matrix, not the last one, that sucked. But <laughs> huge fan of The Matrix, um, huge fan of like the Data Earth stood still, just really a Keanu Reeves fan. Imagine my surprise when I found out that John Wick had been out. I'm like, you mean to tell me this is like old news and I never knew? I'm like, social media is always listening to everything that we say and just giving us ads for stuff that we look up. And you mean to tell me you never told me John Wick was a thing? Anywho, I was mad about that if y'all can't tell. But, um, so I'll, I'll pay for it on YouTube, right? I'm always buying stuff, buying a movie on YouTube. But anywho, um, so I pay for it on YouTube. I'm sitting there and I'm watching it. And you know, it starts off just a teensy, weensy bit slow. I'm like, okay, all right. Poor baby, his wife, you know. Um, and I'm like, okay, he speaks another language there at the gas station. I'm like, okay, real assassin type stuff. You know, they always speak multiple languages. Um, so, you know, he gets into it with the guys, you know, they show up at his house in the next scene and you know they beat him up a lot and i'm just like um this isn't really looking like anybody should be scared of this man like this isn't this isn't really doing anything but i say you know what it's keanu reeves i'm gonna keep watching uh cinematically still really good i'm like okay there's something people are ranting and raving about about this character so i i'm gonna keep watching because i really want to know Oh, like the scene right after that they're like building the character up because they're like okay you got this car from where and then you know like um Vigo calls the shop guy yeah all the spoilers in what I'm talking about right now but um because you know Vigo calls the shop guy whose name I low-key forgot and you know he's like yeah he stole John Wick's car and killed his dog and he's like um okay and he just hangs up <laughs> And I'm like, okay, we're building up the character. He goes around, I'll say offing. He goes around offing everybody in like the best way. All the action scenes, 10 out of 10. Everything is very believable. He looks like he could do it. Um, I'm like, this is awesome. He's offing everybody in like a suit. Uh, he goes to the Continental. I like how, I like business um, type of assassin movies. It, it just looks really good to me. Like everybody's a gentleman, but they also just like off people. I like it. And like everybody's dressed up and the suits are bulletproof and the ladies have on their heels and you know, their nice little hairstyles. Everybody has on their makeup, their jewelry. I'm like, oh, I like this. And they're just like so cute. I love it. I love it. And then I was like, oh, and after the first movie, I was very much so hooked and had to see the second and had to see the third and had to see the fourth and genuinely really like all of them. And I will never stop watching them. Yeah, that's my evolution of, <laughs> that's the evolution of me and John Wick. But yes, guys, I'll see you on the next movie review <laughs> or whatever else I come up with, right? Okay, <laughs> bye.